is the biggest house I've ever seen. It's the Palace of Versailles, home of Marie Antoinette. You know, she was mostly famous for one thing. Cake! I love cake so much! <laughs> Marie Antoinette sure likes cake, Mr. Peabody. Indeed she does. Marie was a woman with a prodigious appetite for all things covered with frosting. But her expensive tastes made her the target of much criticism. Why? Because, Sherman, during Marie's reign, the common people of France were exceedingly poor. You got any bread? No! I'm exceedingly poor! Now can we have some cake? May we? Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> May we have some cake? May we? Maybe she can't hear me through the hair. Sherman, what the queen means is... Ah, let them eat cake! And when the queen heard the poor of Paris could not even buy bread, she said, Let them eat cake! No! Oui, I heard it myself! It's a scandal! It's an outrage! Down with the queen! Down with the monarchy! Wait! What kind of cake? Oh. Vive la révolution! Vive la révolution! Smashing party, your majesty. But now I'm afraid Sherman and I must be... Sherman? Sherman? Sherman! Sherman? Sherman! Dear Sherman! Hey, Mr. Peabody. What are you doing in here? Trying these other cakes. There's one in here with whipped cream and strawberries that's... Pretty fantastic! Sherman, don't you remember why I told you to stay close to me during the French Revolution? Because after the French Revolution, it was gonna rain? Close! I said after the French Revolution comes... the Reign of Terror! Ah! 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 Round up the aristocrats! Must pay the price for their gluttony! We will slaughter them like the dogs they are! Starting with this one! Mr. Peabody! What should I do? Nothing, Sherman! Just stay right there! But Mr. Peabody! Everything's going to be fine, Sherman! Just stay right there! Off with his head! The lowest of the fruits! Who dares to insult me with this man? So what did you learn today, Sherman? That French Revolution was crazy! How so? All those guys getting their heads chopped off, and nobody standing up and saying it wasn't right. And think, Marie Antoinette could have avoided the whole revolution if she'd simply issued an edict to distribute bread amongst the poor. But then, she couldn't have had a dessert. Why not, Mr. Peabody? Because, Sherman, you can't have your cake and edict. Two. <laughs> I don't get it.